was so much fun. It sucks we lost the world. I wish we could just start a new one, build an awesome house, and catch new Pokemon we've never caught before. Dude. We should do that. Wait, before we begin, if you haven't seen any of my other videos that came out before this one, there's a playlist on my channel called 100 Days Pokemon. Check it out if you want to. If you don't, okay. Back to the video. Hello everyone, how is everyone doing? It's been a while since our last Pixelmon video, but I am so happy to be back. So it's been a couple months, and it's been so long in fact that we had time to build this awesome house. So I just wanted to spend our first day just giving you all a tour of our brand spanking new headquarters. You're gonna love it. Alright Nick, give me a tour. Alright, let me show you the new casa. We have potato farm for all your hunger needs. And then we have elevators. You go up the chute into the Battle Arena. Yeah, Battle Mountain has significantly upgraded, I would say, right? So you can take the stairs or elevator. I prefer the elevator. Welcome to, I would say, the pad here. So we have chairs. Yours is the green one, of course, because it's your favorite color. This one's mine because I don't have a favorite color. We have a computer. You could drink some coffee if you would like. We have two washing machines. One's yours, one's mine. A kitchen area. What? Sorry. Had a snack before I before I showed you around. This is this is one of the cooler parts here. So I have improved the lab. So go ahead and take take a gander at our laboratory. Wow, looks state of the art. Yeah. A lot better than our hole in the ground. Though technically it is still a hole in the ground. This was, um, the old el- <laughs> Are you having a hard time? Yeah, it's maximum security. This was the old elevator. Um, I never fixed it. Up to the bedrooms we go. Um, our lookout deck, our observatory. We can see what's going on outside. Our bedroom including the champion's cup because i am the champ we have storage we have our trading post more storage and where i guess the machinery happens here well that's it that's the house i just hope you guys like it now after an entire day of showing you guys around it was time to get some rest and prepare for our new adventure that's my side <laughs> i sleep on the side with the cup because I'm the champion. So thinking back on my other Pixelmon videos, I realized I made a huge mistake, and I plan on rectifying that mistake this episode. After spending 200 days on Pixelmon, I had yet to give the Eevees any love, and that is a crime. I love Eevees, you love Eevees, I don't know anyone who doesn't love the Eevees, so I don't know why we haven't done anything with them yet. So to pay back the universe for my mistakes, we are devoting an entire episode just to Eevee. So let me give Nick the rundown real quick. Alright Nick, so the mission. The mission this episode. We haven't showed Eevee any love. No love. Eevee is so cute. She's so cute. She's cute. Yeah, she's cute. She has like eight or nine different evolutions. All the evolutions. All of them. So to make up for that crime, we're going to devote an entire episode just to Eevee. Eevee episode. So the goal of this episode is for me and Nick to go out into the wild and capture four Eevees each. Next, we're going to care for them, get them some battle experience, and travel the world to collect the stones we need to evolve them into whichever evolution we choose. And finally, to cap it all off, we're doing a throwback to the first episode, we're gonna have an epic final showdown in the new battle arena with our brand new evolutions. This is gonna be one heck of an episode, so I hope you guys are ready because here we go. So to begin our journey, we need to go where the Eevees naturally spawn. In Pixmon, that's the birch biome, so that's where I'm going first. Birch biome? Birch biome. Found one. No, I'm get out it. of my birch biome. I'm in the birch biome. I'm guessing you didn't see the mock bike storage. What? There's you put a bike storage in? <laughs> oh yes, there's one. I'm in the birch forest. Get out of my birch forest, dude! You really I are get in out one. of my birch forest. Out. I'm here, bro. No. Get out of my birch forest. I went into his birch forest anyways. Then I realized I forgot my pokeballs. Why do I always do this? So I left his birch forest momentarily, grabbed my balls, then came back to his birch forest once again, uninvited the following day. I soon realized that my level five Piplup wasn't gonna be much help catching Eevees, so I leveled it up. 
Later, I ran into one of the only Pokemon that can rival an Eevee in cuteness. <gasps> so I had to catch it. Woo! The day continued on, and let me tell you, day 203 turned out to be one magical day. I found a... What? I just found a Master Ball! What is happening right now? What? Liar. <laughs> no. Liar. <laughs> it was you just on the on. ground. <gasps> hey, Pikachu! <laughs> Oh my god. Wow. <laughs> Day 204 rolled around and it wasn't as magical. Actually, it really wasn't magical at all because uh, nothing happened. Day 205 though, not bad. <gasps> yes! You're lying. <laughs> yes, finally. You got it? Got it. On day 206, I headed back home to drop off the items I collected from defeating Pokemon and to grab some more food and balls. Oh yeah, I forgot. This was also when I left to grab dinner. And when I got back, apparently Nick had a pretty good couple of days. Hello, Nicholas. Hey, you. What's up? I got some business with you. What? What is it? I want to fight. No questions asked. You want to fight right now? I want to fight right now. Come on. What you got? We'll fight. You catch any Eevees? Oh, you'll, you'll see what I got. All right. You ready? I'm ready. Let's go then. Oh, you got an Eevee? Me too, buddy. I ain't worried. Now I gotta figure out what's gonna be the best, because I don't know what your Eevee has either. I only have one. And your Eevee's not even full health. You decreased my Eevee's accuracy. Yes! And it avoided the attack! Yes! No. Bam! No! Smoke. Let's go! You avoided the attack again! Let's go! You ready to get smacked? Let's go, Eevee! Mm -mm. Alright, I've, yes! I've had enough. Oh, you think Pikachu's gonna save you? No! Oh, come on, Pikachu. You gotta hit harder than that. No. No! Yes, sir! Golly, I didn't know it was gonna be this easy. <laughs> come on. Come on. No, come on. So close, Piplup. Do, do, do it. I've had enough of this guy. Piplup? No, yes. I'm paralyzed. We're yes. paralyzed. Yes. Yes. Oh, you know what? That's okay. Because I have another Eevee. I'm faster. I'm faster no. and stronger. The Battle of the Bronze. No. Yes. No. Yes! I'm the one who holds the cup. I'm not gonna lie. Getting whooped by Texas Tempo was not the way I wanted to end my day, but here we are. The next day, I woke up with a fire inside me. I was not gonna lose to Nicholas again. I was gonna beat him fair and square, and I'm gonna take his stupid cup. So before I could do that, I needed to put my nose to the grindstone and evolve my Eevees. So first things first, you know I'm getting a Jolteon. Jolteon is freaking amazing and just looks so cool. It's my favorite evolution, so I just have to get it. And in order to do that, we're gonna need nine lightning shards. So excuse me for a moment while I go grab those. Okay, now we have everything we need for Jolteon. We should probably go ahead and catch the rest of our Eevees too. So I'm just gonna take my bed to the Birch Forest so I can search for Eevees during the day and then sleep at night. So I'm not really wasting any time. Good thing I decided to do that because I spent the next six days just running around before I found my first Eevee. <gasps> Perfect. Eevee, we're about to become very good friends. No! Yep, I killed it. After waiting six entire days, I killed it. Now there's no telling when the next TV is going to- Oh my gosh, it's another one. All right, I'm not making the same mistake twice. Come on, Eevee. Be my friend. No, I thought that was it. Oh my gosh. You're making it really hard to be friends. No.
That's what I'm talking about, Eevee. Welcome to the team. All right, just one more. We just need one more Eevee. I guess while I'm just standing around waiting for my last Eevee to spawn, now would be a pretty good time to explain why I chose my team. Okay, so to start it off, I chose my favorite Eevee Lucian, Jolteon. Jolteon is super quick and easy to get. You just need to give it a Thunderstone and bam, boom, bam, you got an awesome Pokemon. The next Eevee Lucian on my team is gonna be the fairy type, Sylveon. This is probably the cutest Eevee Lucian and a little harder to get. First, we have to get an Eevee with a fairy type move, then increase the happiness of the Eevee to at least 220, and finally evolve Eevee in a flower forest, and bam, you got yourself a Sylveon. Third on the team is Old Reliable Vaporeon. Once again, an awesome looking Pokemon and super easy to get. Just give an Eevee a Water Stone, and boom, you got yourself a Vaporeon. I'm really hoping Nick's gonna have a Flareon so I can have a type advantage on him with this one. And last but not least, everyone's favorite Eevee Lucian, Umbreon. You can't help but think this guy's cool. This bad boy requires a little more work as well, but it's not that bad. All we gotta do is get one of our EVs to a happiness of 220 again and evolve it at night. Bada boom, bada bang, you got your awesome Umbreon. And there you go, that's the squad. As long as Nick doesn't have the perfect counter to these Pokemon, I think we're gonna squash them. So now that I've caught this Eevee in a friendship ball, it has a happiness of 200. And like I said before, all we gotta do is get it to 220. So to do that, we're just gonna have to let Eevee run around a little bit until it gets there. It took long enough, but eventually four days later, on day 223, I found my last Eevee. Yes! Now that we have our gang of Eevees, we just need to meet all the requirements to evolve them. We already have the shards for the Thunderstone, so let's go make that happen because I can't wait any longer. Here we go! Gosh, I love seeing that animation. Yes! Jolteon. We finally have my favorite evolution, Jolteon. Okay, so we've got Jolteon. Check that one off the list. Now we just gotta get the other three. First things first, we gotta find a flower biome and hopefully find some water shards along the way. All right, we're heading southeast. Guys, what are the chances of this? I was expecting to find them in like an ocean, but I can't complain. Now we just gotta find this flower biome. Two days later, we found it. The flower forest biome, the place that's gonna make all our Sylveon dreams come true. Okay, so now that we're here in this huge flower field, all we gotta do is level up our Eevee. Oh, that should be it. That should be it. Yes. Oh yeah, here we go. We are finally getting our Sylveon. Sylveon. All right, well, everything kind of worked out perfectly because now that it's night, we can go ahead and get our next evolution. Let's go ahead and just switch out for our Jolteon and we can just share the XP because it's a level 19. So I'm hoping I'll get a big chunk of it. No way! It only took one! It only took one battle! Oh man, Umbreon looks so sick! Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. Let's freaking go, man! Nick doesn't stand a chance! With three out of the four members of the team assembled, all that was left to do was return home, craft the Waterstone, and evolve the last member of my team. Boom, boom, boom! Waterstone, come on out, Eevee! Here we go! Our last Eevee. Oh, a beautiful Vaporeon. I don't know. It's uh, I love Jolteon. He's my favorite, obviously. But after that, it's hard to pick because they all just look so cool. I mean, look at Vaporeon. Now look at Umbreon. Now look at Sylveon. She is so cute. And then finally, the bad boy himself, Jolteon. I just don't know. I love them all. This is why I had to give Eevee its own episode. But what I do know is that with this squadron, Vaporeon, Umbreon, Jolteon, and Sylveon, we are gonna mop the floor with Texas Tempo. I spent the next three days training all my Pokemon to the max level of 20 for our battle. I got to know each of my Eevees and how their moves work. I felt really comfortable with my team and I was feeling so confident. I was finally ready to battle Nick and to take the title of Pixelmon Champion. All right, my team's done. Everyone's finally level 20. I can't wait to show Nick my team and inevitably hear the sound of his voice as he bows before me as Pixelmon Champion. But all that aside, it's also going to be pretty cool just to see which Pokemon Nick has chosen for his team. I really hope his team doesn't counter mine because that would really suck. But ah, uh, who am I kidding? My team's going to do great tomorrow. Everything's going to work out exactly as it should. I can't freaking wait. Hello, Nicholas. 
Howdy, it's good to be back. You got your team ready? Of course I do. I'm always ready. Uh oh, but yeah, I'm. Uh, my team's ready to go. Ready to beat you. Meet me down here at the battle. What do we call this? Are we playing? Are we playing for the cup? We're playing for the God Chalice. What is it called? I don't remember. Uh, I like God Chalice. Also, what are we calling this room? The battle. Ooh. Um, battle. I like battle layer. That sounds pretty good. Battle layer. Okay. Oh no! The battle cave. It's like the bat cave. Right. I think I'm ready to throw out my uh my first one. All right. Let me see what you're working with, dude. I wonder. I wonder which ones you have. Ready? Ready. Three, two, one. Well, that didn't work. That didn't work. And this is not good for me. Okay, I chose fairly well. Yes, I picked the worst one. Since Nick read my mind somehow, I had to hurry up and get Vaporeon out of there. Against Jolteon, Vaporeon did not stand a chance. You withdrew him? Yeah. You have Sylveon, bro? <laughs> yeah, she's too cute. Sylveon took a couple of good blows, but turns out it could hit pretty hard too. Hey, yo, what? Hold that, up. that was pretty good. It was getting a little too hard for Nick's liking, so he had a change of heart. Oh, you're taking out, I taking have a him out of on. Oh yeah. my god, it's so big! It's like <laughs> a it? horse! You're like, oh my <laughs> god! After trading shots with his huge Pokemon, my Sylveon was still feeling the effects of its battle with Jolteon. My Sylveon is paralyzed and yes, cannot move. Yes, it's still paralyzed. Will you please hit Sylveon? No, oh my god! Yes! Yes! Take it out! Oh my yes! god. Yes! Well, we're already down one Pokemon. Here we go, baby. Oh, you got a Jolteon too! Yeah, what do you think about that one? Yes! I was beginning to panic. At this rate, Sylveon was going to take down another one of my Pokemon. I had to do something, and I had to do it quick. Wait. Yes! No, what am I doing? Bring him out! No, what am I doing? Why did I bring that one out? Yes! Oh my god, I, I'm throwing. I panicked and I threw out Umbreon, which was super weak to Sylveon and a super dumb oh mistake. Oh man, she's starting to hum, boys. She's starting to hum. If I didn't do something quick, I was going to lose to Nick. Get out, get out, get out, get out. She's starting to hum. Oh my gosh. With only three HP, there wasn't much my Jolteon could do. It was only one she's attack coming. away from being knocked out. That wasn't enough. Okay. That wasn't enough. That's okay. Goodbye. No. Yes! Yes! No! Yes! It worked! It worked! No! Yes! Hey, you know what? That's okay. That is... We are... We are okay. We're golden. Whoa! What? What? I just gained health? You just absorbed it! Volt Absorb drew in the attack and healed Jolteon. Thank you! You're cheating. Thanks, Nick! God. Why'd you do it again? <laughs> I'm throwing, I'm throwing, I forgot which one I picked. Yes! No! I'm throwing. <laughs> I did it again! What are you doing, Texas Tempo? What is that? Let's go, OG! Oh, oh my gosh. No! Oh, oh dude, I threw. <laughs> You healed Jolteon all the way back up. I don't know how. No, I was so confident. <laughs> what are you gonna do now? Well, yeah, it, it's gotta go. Espeon knocked out my Jolteon, but with two Pokemon left, I had this in the back. I'm still paralyzed? <laughs> yes! <laughs> what the heck? Nick, you know what this means, right? No, you get the crown. <laughs> no! <laughs>